Hello, my sweet, beautiful friends. In today's video, I have an impromptu full Dollar Tree haul and I'm freaking blown away by the items that I found. So you do not wanna miss it. Stick around. If that's something you're interested in, then just keep watching. Hey friends, so y'all know how I do my hauls. I'm not gonna edit this because, well, I say that, but then I edit it because I like to add and show you. Anyway, I'm gonna do my best to very minimally <laughs> edit this video. Y'all know how I roll. So thank you for being here and let's not waste any time. Let's jump in. Y'all, I am freaking blown away, okay? Every single season that rolls around, I'm blown away. Like they're getting better and better and better as time goes on. Um, I have the fan on, it's hot as hell here. So hopefully that does not bother you. And I am, I'm just gonna pick at random. I kind of have everything in a bag here. Um, so I'm gonna start with the non fall items and there's only a few um, just because this is a fall video, but look at these fake nails. Okay. Now I get my nails done. I get my nails done, but for a dollar 25, well, first off I needed the nail glue. So they didn't just have any like in a, just like by itself. So I grabbed this for the nail glue sometimes cause you know, with all these damn kids these days, <laughs> it's hard to get to the nail salon like every two weeks so sometimes my nails will like lift and then i just have to put a little bit of glue under to like get me through till i can get them done um but i thought that if i ever run into a situation where i cannot get my nails done then i have these and i thought they were stunning i also saw a bunch of different patterns as well um so as always if i have a video of the things i'll pop it up on the screen for you guys but i picked up one of those i also found this heated lash curler like what at dollar tree it takes one triple a battery so i thought that was pretty cool i don't know how good it works i will test it and let y'all know the next non-fall item but these are old news but let me tell you, pick these up. If you guys like to follow along on DIYs with me, I'm not gonna tell you what, but I have a really amazing idea in my head. So pick up the little doll houses. Y'all know spooky season is coming and I might have a trick up my sleeve. So I bought two of the white ones and then one of the purple ones. I kind of like this design better, but they're both super cute. So my kids go in my shed and then they're like, mom, can I play with this? And then I'm like, sure, whatever. So they have claimed, claimed <laughs> all my other doll houses. So I did go ahead and just replenish. I can't ever freaking talk. Replenish my stash. <laughs> Someday God will bless me with uh, the ability to actually speak correctly. Now we're gonna get into the fall stuff. And I grabbed these for my kids because Y'all, they have so many new craft, like kids craft items this year, um, like a whole wall full. And I was blown away. This is really good for any moms who homeschool or just like weekend or after school activities. These are perfect. It comes with all of the supplies in it to make this little guy right here. So I picked up one of each for my girls. The next items, these are not new either, but I loved them so much. And um, I only have one of each from last year. I also have an idea for these in mind. So I did just pick up one of each. And I do believe there was one more color, but these were the two that I picked up, like the natural colored ones. As always, if you guys see any of these items in your stores, let me know. Um, let me know which item was your favorite as well down in the comment section. These are from last year, right? 
Um, I thought they were super, super cute. The blue, I don't even know why I grabbed the blue, to be honest, but I thought the blue was super pretty. Um, but again, these are old news. However, I did not see these last year. Aren't they cute? Little acorn picks. I thought they were so stinking cute. Have you guys seen these? Do you like these? Do you not? This is one of those items I look at it and I'm not sure like if majority of people would like something like this. Um, but I did pick up two of those. And then I thought this was really cool too, but like I wouldn't use it. I just thought it was cute. Um, and I wanted to show you guys. Look at this. Scarecrow chair cover. So that would be so cute for like Thanksgiving or you could make like a pillow out of it. Possibilities are endless with this. Again, it's not my style. It's not my favorite, but I did think it was cute and cool for a dollar twenty-five quality out of the bag, if you will. Um, but look at that pumpkin. Okay, now we're getting into the nitty gritty. <laughs> so they have brand new ribbons out. They did have ribbons from last year as well but I just picked up the ones that I personally liked and did not have already. So, and Jenny Lee, my good friend Jenny Lee, go over to her channel, check her out, because she's the one who inspired me to go shopping. Because y'all, when I tell you that I was literally just at Dollar Tree this past weekend and they didn't have any of this stuff out. And then I saw Sunday that she got a bunch of stuff so I went on Monday and they were just putting this stuff out. So these are Jenny Lee inspired. She's a very good friend of mine. Go check her out. Um, but look at those stinking gorgeous colors. That blue color scheme, the blue buffalo check. Now they did have different patterns, like I said, but I just grabbed the ones that I personally liked and would use. Look at this little wheelbarrow with the pumpkins in it. Oh, isn't that so cute? Let me know in the comments, which one was your favorite? Now these are brand new as well. Now they always have like these little stands. Um, they always have the stands, however, um, these are new patterns and they did have a bunch of other patterns as well, but these were the two that I thought were super cute. So I did just pick up one of each of these. I never really know like exactly what to do with these, but I know that I'll figure something out. So I did just pick up one of each. And then along the same lines, along the same line, these are just like little trinket trays. <gasps> Aren't they so good? Aren't they so freaking good? Look at that color, that blue. Oh my gosh, with the detailing right here. I loved those. They did have different colors, different patterns, blah, blah, blah as well. But these were the two that I picked up. Okay, these are old news, but they changed them up this year. The mini hay bales. Um, last year, the hay bales actual actually had real hay on them. This year, it's just like, a little, I don't know. Anyway, y'all can see what I'm talking about, right? It's not actual hay. It's like, I don't know, it reminds me of like dust, like sawdust. Um, I mean, you still get the point. It still looks like a bale of hay, but I like the old ones that are like more realistic. But I did pick up two just to replenish my stash. I do think I have like one pack of the old ones, but I wanted to make sure that I had um, more for fall DIYs. Now y'all, the signs are insane. <laughs> they're getting so good with the signs that you don't even need to DIY them. Now they're not my, like I like to just DIY my own decor. So even though they're like perfect, some of them I would leave as is and put up, but some of them I will DIY just because I'm just partial to DIY obviously. Um, but you can let me know down in the comments um, if you guys would like DIY them or leave them as is. So the first one is this welcome sign. 
Isn't she so pretty? Now, of course, they have that stupid glitter, but it's minimal. It's not a whole lot. Um, and it has like this 3D leaf image with the raffia bow. I thought that that was absolutely gorgeous. So I did pick up one of those. And then the next sign that I picked up is this autumn. Now it's shaped like a pumpkin. It's shaped like a pumpkin at the top. It's got that 3D piece, same thing, right? Isn't that so cute? Autumn blessings with the little barn in the back. And it's like a real long pumpkin. I love that. But I really do just like the shape, to be quite honest. Like, I like the image, um, but I probably would DIY it. I probably would DIY it. I got it for the shape of the sign. Now, this one especially I got for the shape of the sign. Um, I, the saying is okay. Definitely not my favorite. I would not put this up in my house. But it is a faux cutting board and like a long one. I've never seen this shape at Dollar Tree before. It says fall. Tis the season to be thankful. Now, I like the saying, but I just don't like the design, if that makes sense. And this little pumpkin, either sweet potato pie or pumpkin pie, it is a 3D piece. Um, so I thought that they really did that well, but it's not my style. So I did pick up two of these for the shape of the sign. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> these I really, really love. I really love these. I really love these. Are you for real? Like Dollar Tree. You're killing me. You're freaking killing me, Dollar Tree. <gasps> Look at that, y'all. Okay, now this is perfect. This is literally perfect. And I have the best idea for this. Look how realistic that wood looks. These are 3D. Now, I kind of wish like this green part was 3d as well but what are you gonna do for a dollar 25 so i thought they did that really well farm fresh pumpkin patch hay rides corn maze hot cider <gasps> they did that y'all they freaking did that so i picked up two of these um one to do a diy with as is and then again the shape of the sign i have never seen before so these will be perfect to diy with as well Okay, they did have one more pattern. I couldn't think of the word. So there's that one. Look at that. Fall breeze, autumn leaves. Now it's not my favorite design, okay? I don't really like the sunflowers. Um, I don't like all that glitter. But I did think that that little wagon was cute. Again, that's a 3D piece. But this one I just got to show you and to have for um, DIYing. So there's that one. I only picked up one of these. I don't know if I said that, but one of those, two of the other pattern. Okay, now these I have never seen before either. Um, although I usually don't pick up the yard stakes, but you guys can let me know if you've ever seen these particular signs before. I have never seen them, but I thought that they were so cute. I love them. Again, I just want to DIY with them because of the handles um, and the signs. So you could totally like remove the shovel part and like just like redo it. But even still, even if you didn't, I really like it. Um, I don't know, I can't decide, I can't decide. But I did buy them with the intention of DIYing them. So I picked up one of each. I did not see any other patterns. The next sign, I do believe this is old. This is from last year, but again, I have a really good idea for this one. So I did just pick up one of those trucks. Only picked up one of those. Okay, okay, okay. All right, let me move closer again. Y'all are gonna love these. Y'all are gonna love them. Like, wow, Dollar Tree, you did that. You did that. You did that. 
y'all. Do you see it? Isn't it so cute? Okay, so this little middle, middle piece, the round middle piece, that is a 3D piece. I love the raffia bow with the wooden like shiplap in the background. The farm fresh pumpkins, pick your own with the truck. I mean, I'm super weird. I only like certain shapes of trucks. Like if they look too animated or like cartoonish, I'm just not a big fan of it. Am I weird? Is that me or not? But I just, I don't know. I love this one though. I love it. They did an amazing job with this one. Then you also have the pumpkin patch, five cents a pound, you pick. Now this one is not my favorite, but I did think they did a good job. Um, but like these other two, I got to DIY. So um, they have this pattern and then they also have this one. Now this one, again, I'm not the biggest fan of. I don't really like that flower for fall. Um, but again, I'm really impressed nonetheless. So those three signs. All right, y'all, we're coming down to the nitty gritty on the signs. Look at those. I love these, okay? I love those colors. Now this one, again, I mean, I know it's like fall, but I don't know. The sunflowers, they're just not my style. If you like sunflowers, don't come for me. I totally get it. We all have different opinions and tastes and eyes and what we like and what we don't like, right? I personally am just not a huge fan of sunflowers. I do like them on some things, but like, I feel like they could have left the sunflowers out of this one, but that's just me. I do love the pumpkins. I do love like the background shiplap. I love fall most of all. I love the wording. So all in all, it's a pretty good sign, but I would DIY on the back. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Do you like the sunflowers or do you agree like they could have left those out? And then for this one, love this one i love it i love it so much like see how this one is just plain with the pumpkins and the shiplap background i absolutely adore that they did this one really really well with the colors of the pumpkins and everything bless this home i love that and then the last like hanging sign um that's already like done up now they did have several different patterns Again, I'll pop them. Again, I will pop them up on the screen for y'all, but I really just liked this piece. <laughs> I seen Jenny Lee haul little chunky signs like these, but mine didn't have it yet. So I will go back because when I went to my Dollar Tree, they were like just putting this stuff out and I was like, oh my God. They know me. So they're like, yeah, girl, go ahead, get whatever you want. Now for the unfinished wood signs. These are not new. Um, I got two of these just to replenish my stash. These are from years and years. They always bring these unfinished ones out. Um, so I did just pick up two to replenish. And then, y'all, Dollar Tree. You're really doing it big. Okay, how stinking cute are these? Look at those. <gasps> With the, okay, so this wood piece, right? The pumpkin is raised. My buddy just woke up. Now, hi, friends. I'm getting such a big boy. I'm getting to be such a big boy. Aww. Did you just wake up? Oh, there's a big boy happy to be awake. Got a big boy, baby. Say clap clap. Say clap clap, friends. So we got a little one nose because we got tea first coming in. Clap clap. Oh, he's so smart. Say yay yay. Yay yay yay. Say yay yay yay. <laughs> I love being a mom more than anything in this whole world. 
Okay, y'all. Miss Rachel. Thank God for Miss Rachel. Um, all right. So, there's that one. It's raised. Okay. So, back to what I was saying. Look how good that is. So, this pumpkin is like raised. And then this part is like a laser, um, like, detail, if you will. So, I thought that those were so gorgeous. I love that. So, I did pick up two of that pattern. And then I also picked up two of this pattern. I love this one as well. So, again, the middle pumpkin is raised. And then these are, like, laser details. I thought they did really good with these. I'm super impressed for $1.25. Now, they're not the most thick uh, wood round, but y'all, like, what are you gonna do? A wood sign is just gonna sit on a shelf or on a door or like wherever you put it anyway, right? So, I feel like, in my personal opinion, $1.25 is really good for this sign. I would pay that over and over again. I don't know. Let me know down in the comments what y'all think. Do you think that's a good deal or do you think it's not a good deal? <laughs> okay, for the last of the signs, I love these. Okay, I freaking love these. They, they Dollar Tree did this. They do this. They did that. Y'all, for real? Okay, Dollar Tree, I see you. Now, these are like natural faux wood. This one is. I'm not a big fan of this ribbon, so I would probably change that out. But I do like that as is. That I would definitely put on my tiered tray or shelf or whatever. So they did that one really well. I like that. Now, this one... Um, it's almost like a sticker, like it's soft, if that makes sense. You can kind of see, maybe you can't, but this is like a sticker. But I still thought that that was super cute. I love the bow, I love this one. And then this one is that natural wood as well. I don't know if you can like see the difference. But I love this one too with the bow. Autumn Harvest Blessings, Falling Leaves, Give Thanks, Pumpkin Patch. So I think, or I thought that they did a really good job with these. Now they're just like the square signs, but they just added like more details to them. So I love that. Yes, Dollar Tree, bring us more stuff like this. I get so excited. Does anybody else just get like so freaking excited? Like ah, new stuff. I know, I have a problem but I guess that's why I'm here. <laughs> we all equally have the same problem, right? <laughs> it's a disease, I swear. The Dollar Tree disease. Okay. So, there's those. Okay, y'all. These are brand new as well. I thought they were so cute. The Scarecrow hats. But I only picked up one pack because I don't really know what I'm going to do with them. But I thought they were super cute. And so I picked up one pack and they obviously come with four in a pack. I love how they have the little green buffalo check pieces. So these I have never seen before at um, Dollar Tree either. So burlap stickers. They're super cute. But... They're kind of not my style either, but I thought they were kind of cute. So I just picked up one pack just in case. You never know what you're going to need until you need it, right? Okay, and then I also picked these up. I thought those were super cute. Felt stickers. Now, if I don't use these, my girls can use them. Um, they did have different ones too, like Scarecrow and something else. I can't remember exactly, but I'll pop that up for y'all but I did just pick up one pack of these. Now these are from last year and probably the year before, but um, again, I'm not a big fan of sunflowers, but I do sometimes use them. So I did pick up one pack of the big ones, two packs of the small. Oh, I thought this was so cute. 
Look at this wreath hanger. And y'all, they had tons of other ones. They had tons and tons of different designs. I just think they were so, these are so good because in years prior, they just have like this cut, like plain without this added detail to it. So I thought that they did that really, really nicely. I mean, it's gorgeous, right? So I did pick up one wreath hanger. Okay, and I did pick up a bunch of pumpkins. Um, I don't know if they had these last year. I'm pretty sure they had this one. Super beautiful. I love that. And the glitter is not, like, I, I feel like the glitter doesn't really come off of this like that. So, I was cool with that. These are perfect for tear trays, perfect for displays, perfect for all kinds of stuff. So, I grabbed one of them. Plus, the stems are really gorgeous. They're pretty realistic. So I picked up one of these, one of these. I feel like these are a new pattern this year, um, but y'all can let me know. I've never seen them before. So I did pick up one of these, one of these, like I said, um, one orange one. This is a different shape. I kind of like tried to get a variety of shapes so like, for instance, this one is even a different shape. Yeah, actually these are same shape, different color, but I liked both the colors. So one of each of those. And then last but not least, this like taller one. So there's that, how stinking cute. And they're really good size too. Like, I mean, I don't have a overly large head, but I mean, you get what I'm saying. They're pretty good size. All right, y'all. If you stuck with me this long, leave a pumpkin emoji down below. Y'all are the real OGs, which means original gangster, which means like you stuck with me, which means I greatly appreciate you. So let me know you guys are still here if you are and know that I love you so much and appreciate you. Don't forget to share this out as well if you enjoy my content. It shows YouTube that you enjoy my content. They will show you more of my content and they will also push it out to other people and that's just just a way for me to grow and um, get in front of more people um, because they think like if you like it and other people like it and share it and comment and all the things then more people will and it's just a way that you could help me out for free so I greatly appreciate you okay these are brand new I have never seen these before and these are just the like I don't even know what you, like, what would you do with these? I don't even know. I mean, I know I could come up with something. I'm just saying like, what is the point of this? Um, I guess you could like, I don't know. But anyway, they're like the beaded rounds. They have beautiful little ribbons, different ribbons as well. So this one has more of like a braid, well, a braided ribbon with the Buffalo check leaf. And then this one has the little pumpkin that says blessed. And I love this ribbon. I actually have some of that ribbon from Dollar Tree. And I loved how they did like orange and natural wood. And they did have different patterns as well. But these were the two that I really liked. Again, I wasn't too sure like what I wanted to do. I also used to pick up like double of everything. But I've just since learned that like it just sits around and y'all, I have so much stuff as it is. So I'm trying to be a good girl. It's really hard, but I'm trying. So I did just pick up one of each of those. And then the last items that I picked up and I'm truly blown away with how long these are um and the details on them like y'all look how freaking long these garlands are like i could not believe i mean holy moses right here's the end and here's the other end so these would be really cute on a mantle just like this oh my goodness excuse me all that water um they would be really cute on a mantle like kind of like that um i loved the galvanized leaf 
So they have three galvanized leaves on this one. And then I'm not a fan. I mean, like, come on. <laughs> That's the tassel you put on here. dollar tree you could have done better than that okay like that had me cracking up so i would probably change out the tassel but all in all i think they did pretty good for a dollar 25 um let me know what you guys think and then for this one they have three sunflowers and then this like pink tassel that didn't make any sense to me so i was like <gasps> oh my god that's hilarious right um i don't know i thought it was funny maybe i'm the crazy one but let me know what you guys think of the little tassel <laughs> do you think that's comical as well or am i a crazy person i don't know so oh no wait i thought that was it but one last well 10 last items, but it's the same thing, just different colors. Y'all, I cannot wait to DIY with these. I freaking love these. <gasps> these are brand new florals. Look how stinking gorgeous these are. I like wanted to take the whole freaking case, but I didn't. I was a good girl. I'm not the type of person to like take everything so nobody else can get anything. I'm very mindful that like, once the stuff is gone, nobody can get it. So I don't like to just like take everything, you know? I don't think that's right. But they have this beautiful like burgundy color. So I got two of each. Um, so I got the burgundy. I did not see any other colors. I got the purple. Aren't they so stinking pretty? The purple, um, the like natural tan color. And let me know which color is your favorite in these. I picked up two of like the orange. Aren't they so good? Oh my God. I love them, I love them, I love them. So two of the orange. And then last but not least, I really, really love these because they're like multicolored, if you can tell. Um, it's like burgundy and yellow, but it gives it like this beautiful color. I don't know, but I loved these as well. Aren't they so beautiful? And these, you don't even have to do anything. These would be so gorgeous in a vase sitting somewhere. Um, so yeah, love, love, love these. So like I said, let me know down in the comments, which item was your favorite. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. If I find any other new items, of course, I will bring them to you. And thank you guys for being here again. Don't forget to share this out. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you enjoyed this video, I mostly do DIYs, but if I find good stuff at Dollar Tree, I love to bring them to you guys. I also love to teach people how to earn online income. Um, I have been affiliate marketing for four years while I have had my channel. And just recently I joined a new high ticket affiliate program that I would love to share with you guys. I know that we are so conditioned into thinking that money is so hard to be made. But for somebody like such as myself who doesn't have a fancy degree, I have a checkered past. Like I, I thought that I could never actually get anywhere because I can't get a corporate job. So when I came online and started earning money, I realized my passion for helping other people who either don't know you can earn money super easy online or for those who just need some guidance. So that's why I kind of do a, a number of different things because I like to help people in any way possible. Rather that's show the items I find at Dollar Tree or DIY or help you look and feel good again or help you earn money online. I'm just that type of person where I'm super curious about lots of different things. And so 
this is a new venture. Um, I'm, I've been super successful with it. Lots of other people are, y'all, the person I used her link, she made $37,000 in three weeks. I'm not even kidding you. I have the screenshots to prove it. Okay, like mind blowing money money that will change your life. So if you're interested, text my number, the word affiliate. I will get you guys all of the information. You do have to invest in yourself and your business, you guys. If you knew the amount of money that I invested in this YouTube channel, you would be blown away because it takes money to make money. But when you invest in the right mentor and you invest in the right things, your future is golden. So I love y'all so much. I will get off my soapbox. I just love you guys from the bottom of my heart and want to help you in any way I possibly can. With that being said, if nobody has told you today, you are absolutely stunning. You are worthy. You are gorgeous. You can do anything you set your mind to. Coming from an addict who is nine years sober. Oh my God, you guys. Nine years sober. If I can do it, I know you can do it as well. I love y'all so much and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye. Check out the videos that are popping up here to your left while you're waiting on my next upload or join the DIY fam here to your right.